Don't tell me when I and where I meet with you. you. You stand right here and tell me what you're doing in the building, taking pictures. You can't identify yourself. Out. Do you have ID? I do not have it on me, no. Okay. What's your name? I didn't give it to you. I'm asking for it. Okay, but did I break a law? No. So why do I need to give you ID? He just flipped out and started asking my name, mm -hmm. and now you're asking my name. Right. And I have to give it to you, apparently, or else what, I'm going to be arrested? No, I'm asking for your name. Well, I was just wondering why I had to leave. Uh, because I told you to. Welcome back to the Lackluster Channel. Today's story comes from trg for utv Be sure to head over and let them know I sent you. January 7th, 2019. TRG visited the City Hall of Brewer, Maine to conduct a First Amendment audit. I'm going to be doing a First Amendment audit on the Brewer Town office, or the City Hall, I should say. We're going to go over and uh, see if they respect our rights to record in public. He began the tour by showing the architecture and historic items on the grounds. It's a pretty cool looking building. I don't know if that whole building is like all the way up there and stuff. So they got like a bell right here. Nothing really, nothing really on it or anything. That's their sign. So it's a veterans memorial. TRG eventually makes his way inside in search of the city manager to inquire about the town's history and other information. Caution, microwave in use? What? It says, please walk in, don't mind if I do. How's it going? Is this a uh, open to the public office? Yeah. How can we help you? Uh, I'm just looking around. Never been to brewer so I figured I'd come and hang out thank you I appreciate that you guys have like a, a town manager or something like that top of the stairs nice is all this over here open I won't go inside the offices obviously but I just kind of want to look at the stuff on the walls it's cool What's that? Do you have any questions we can answer for you? Uh, I usually like to ask the town managers because they usually have a little bit more knowledge of the, the history of the town and stuff like that. But, yeah. But thanks for asking, though. Appreciate it. Yeah, right at the top of the stairs on the right is the manager's office. Okay. After a few minutes, the city manager comes downstairs to greet TRG, but is immediately aggressive. Hey, what's up? Nothing much. Are you the city manager? I am. Nice. Can we step out here? You can talk to me right here. Well, this uh, this is kind of crowded. Don't tell me when I and where I meet with you. So well, I'm going to tell me going, what you're doing right now. I'm going to be going in here. You you stand right here and tell me what you're doing in the building, taking pictures. Taking pictures. Yeah. Is that a problem? It is. You Why? Need to check through my office. Well, I was going to go. I was going to go meet with you first, but yeah. And you are. I didn't give my name. I'm just a cameraman. Okay, you can be escorted out of the building right now. If you can't identify yourself, out. What? What's the matter? The it, door. Don't, don't, don't out. touch me, sir. Please. You can go out, or I'll have the police come. What is wrong? This is a public building. <clears throat> I don't understand what the problem is. Really? Yep. Wow. I'll be right down. Why don't you hang around? Oh, I will. Like to meet you. Don't worry about it. I will. Okay. I was going to ask you a couple of questions. I don't know why you're getting so upset over a camera. You guys have cameras all over this place. What's your name, sir? We'll just wait till the police come. Wow, we got off to a wrong foot. Yeah, we sure did. Why is we that? We sure did. You don't like cameras? I don't think you really need to be talking right now. I don't need to be talking? Yeah. Why is that? Because I'm not interested in talking with you. Am I breaking a law right now? I'm not interested in talking to you. We'll just wait and you can talk all you want with an officer. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Sure. I'll just hang in here with you. you got quite an attitude. No, I was just going to walk You've through the door. you quite an attitude. I have quite an attitude? Yeah, you really do. Okay. That's interesting. Mm -hmm. 
So I'm assuming you're going to have me trespass from the building, right? Because I have a camera. Why don't you just wait till the cop gets here? Well, I'm asking you. Not interested in talking. Okay. Why are you not interested in talking to me? Do you know me or something? Because I don't know you. I came here to meet you. I did. Came here to ask you a couple of questions about the town brewer. You don't like talking to the public? Would you just be quiet? I'm not interested in talking to you. Okay. I have the right to talk. I didn't say you didn't. Well, you're telling me over I'm and over you to be quiet. I'm not interested in listening to you. You so, can tell it to the police officer. Do you, do you think the police are going to arrest me or something? Is that what you think they're going to do? A few more minutes goes by, and Officer Tardif of the Brewer Police Department arrives on scene. Have you had other people come to your office and give you a hard time with cameras? Or? How's it going, Officer? Hi there, how are you? Doing good. A guy's been wandering around the building, taking pictures, refuses to identify himself. Uh, I, just, and, I just walked in and went in there, and that's all I did. will not tell me why he's in the building, will not identify himself, and I said I would call the police, yeah. and you're here, and I, she has yeah, taken from there. The guy, the guy has, yes, the guy's had got an attitude five miles long, so just get ready for it. Good, step aside. Okay. Okay, you're being asked to leave. Why are you touching me for? Because you're being asked to leave. You're, Am you're I being not. arrested? Or? No, but you're being asked to leave the building. Okay. I don't mind leaving the building, but I really don't understand why everyone's having a hard time with me having a camera. Okay. TRG is escorted outside, and in the coming moments, the officer tries to issue a criminal trespass. Title 17, Section 402, Subsection 1D states that a person is guilty of criminal trespass if they remain in a place in defiance of a lawful order to leave that was personally communicated to that person by the owner or another authorized person. The city manager did ask TRG to leave for not identifying himself. You can't identify yourself. Out. However, the city manager also invited TRG to stay multiple times. You, you stand right here and tell me what you're doing in the building, taking pictures. Why don't you hang around? Oh, I will. like to meet you. Don't worry about it, I will. Once the officer made it clear that TRG was to leave the building, he complied, and at this point, beyond being confused if he should stay or go, has committed no crime. What's your name? I didn't give it. Okay. Did I break a law? You're being asked to leave. Okay. I, okay. I've left the building. Do you want me to step to the sidewalk? Uh, eventually, yes. Okay. Do you have ID? I do not have it on me, no. Okay. What's your name? I didn't give it to you. I'm asking for it. Okay, but did I break a law? No. So why do I need to give you ID? Because I'm investigating a criminal trespass. They asked you to leave and you refused. I didn't refuse. I wanted to talk to him. Okay. And now you're talking to me? Yeah. What's your name? I didn't give it to you. Do I have to give you my name? I'm asking you for your name. Okay, but do I have to give you my name? I'm asking you for your name. You can call me Good Citizen. Okay. Stay with him just for a minute and see what you can get. Okay. Talk to Steve. I mean, if you guys want me off the property, I'll gladly leave. Okay. I have no problem with that. Okay. What's your name? Officer Gunn. Gunn? Yeah. Wow. You must be a good uh, good officer then, huh, with that name? Gunn? <laughs> have you been with the Brewer Police a long time? I have. What brought you here today? Just taking pictures of the building. I wanted to get some information on the town. Oh, really? Do you live here? No. Nope. No. You looking to move here? Uh, I don't know. I mean, maybe eventually. Police interrogations use several tactics to gain information voluntarily. Interrogations are commonly referred to as interviews, as the term sounds less threatening. These interviews often begin by asking for background information. Asking simple questions and engaging in small talk allows the suspect to feel at ease which can elicit voluntary responses to the questions. Once a suspect begins answering as though they are in a consensual conversation, the interrogation continues with questions about the crime. Typically, this happens by emphasizing potential consequences for refusing to admit guilt or simply accusing the suspect of having committed the act. On the contrary, they may also minimize the suspect's hand in the crime, 
and the associated consequences of his or her actions for the purpose of eliciting a confession. No matter what tactic they apply, it is always best to reserve your right to remain silent. Yeah, where are you from originally? I'm from Maine. Yeah. I live in Maine, yeah. Yeah. You don't live anywhere around here, though? Uh, not around here, no. 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 Did you go around to other city halls and take pictures and look at other city halls? I mean... I know what you're doing right now, but yeah, I, I, I do I'll go to other conversation. places. I don't have to ask you anything. Well, I don't have to answer anything that you're asking me. I mean, he was very aggressive with me as soon as I walked in. Yeah. I don't know why. I just kind of wanted to ask him a couple of questions about the town. Okay. As I do when I go to other places, I am a photographer. Yeah. Um, so this I is something video. normal that you do. You go to like city halls and, and ask questions. And... I go to police stations too. I was actually planning on going to the police station right after this. Yeah talking to you guys and well i guess you don't have to do that now do you because <laughs> you're talking to us no here. I, st I still need to go to the police station okay. yeah yeah i still need to go yeah that's that's just a it's a thing i do you okay. know i want to talk to uh either your chief or something else i mean i'm wondering why he's so aggressive too like what's his name corporal tardiff corp so he's a corporal yeah why is he so aggressive I, never I said mean, that. you're you're pretty. I never, I never said that he was. You're being pretty cordial with me, but him, I don't understand. Like, why is he being aggressive? I don't. Asking for my name. Do you really need my name? I do, at this point, yes. Okay, why? Because you're being trespassed from this property, so I need to give you a criminal trespass notice. You need to give me a criminal trespass notice. Yes. Okay. He said this is something normal that he does. He goes around to city halls and takes pictures and asks a lot of questions. And he also I ask goes, about the towns and stuff and, like that. I want to know information on the town. Why is that a big deal? I don't and understand. Goes, and he also goes to local police and, departments. And I'm wondering... You're causing concern to the staff here. Causing concern by walking in and taking pictures of the walls? Yes. Okay. okay. Interesting. This is the first town hall. I've been to a lot of city halls and town halls in Maine. Mm -hmm. Including the Capitol building. Okay. And they never complained. I don't understand why this place is doing that. Well, you made them feel uneasy. Because I have a camera. They have cameras all over the place. There's one right there. There's a couple inside. Mm -hmm. You know? Are we blocking the entrance? Yes, we are. Well, let's get away from the entrance. I don't want to block the entrance. I'm not here I'm not here to cause a disturbance or anything okay, like that. This way? This way? Yep, my cruiser's parked out front. You'll see it. We're gonna talk Did you drive here today? Um, well, since I don't live in this area, how else would I get here? Well, you could walk or take a bus. No. That city bus actually drives right by here. The route actually goes well, right Well, that's only here. if I live in Bangor, right? No, you can. Anyone can take the bus. The bus goes all over the state? It goes all over Brewer. It goes all over Bangor, Hamden. It goes all over the place. So you could have taken the bus to come here. Okay. I guess. I mean, people do it all the time. That's why I am. Yeah, no... I didn't take a bus. So at this point, I'm being criminally trespassed from the building even though I broke no laws. Yes, you're being asked to leave, and they don't want you back. Okay. Do you have any business to do here? Well, I was going to take a look at some of the stuff that they had inside on the walls. What do you have any business to do here, though? That's my question. Well, my business is this. But you don't have any official business to do with the city of Brewer? Yeah, I was going to ask the the guy inside the manager about the city okay. I wanted to ask him about the city and he just flipped out and started asking my name mm -hmm. and now you're asking my name right and I have to give it to you apparently or else what I'm gonna be arrested no I'm asking for your name okay but do I have to give you my name I need to fill out a criminal trespass notice for you not to return here well I just won't come back that's okay. all it is well you're still gonna get a criminal trespass notice. that's why we need your name but if I don't give you my name then what that's, I'm just trying to ask questions. So if I don't give you my name, how do you give me the trespass notice? Well, it'll be issued to you. Yeah, but how I'll, are you going to... I'll give you a paper copy. Oh, okay. So you won't be able to get my name. Is that... Because I'm just trying to ask a question. Why, why, if I don't give you why my name... You give me your name? Because I don't want to be on your police report. I haven't broken any laws. No. Just to be... You won't be on a police report if... Just because somebody somebody can be in a police report and not break a law. Just right. because just because but, you're on a police report doesn't mean you've broken a law. 
Well, apparently I have. That's why I'm being criminally, criminally trespassed from here, even though I haven't broken a law. They're asking you to leave, and they have the right to do that because they can say who comes on their property and who can't come on their property. It's just like any other business in town. If they, um, don't, if they, don't, if they don't want to I'd have to, to disagree with you there. You're wrong. I can tell you right now. If, how it's how just, is that a business? That's the it's, city it's, of town hall. The our, city town it's, hall. It's our city office, and they conduct business here. They right. have a right to say who can come here and who can't come here. Okay. It's just like any other store in town. If you, well, a if store you, is a private business. This is open to the public. Is it not? Unless they unless they decide that they don't want you there. In that, in that case, yes, you're not wanted here anymore. I'm not wanted because I have a camera. I don't... All, That's the only reason I'm not wanted here. Listen, if I, I walked through listen, that building... I don't, I, don't, I don't know why you're not wanted here. All I know is... I'm that, not wanted because I have a camera. How's it going, officer? Hi there, how are you? Doing good. So, the guy's been wandering around the building, taking pictures... Refuses to identify himself. Uh, I'm not. I don't know if that's why. Come they want on you here now. Or not. No, I'm not agreeing to that because I don't know okay. why they don't want you here. All I know is that. They, so I'm just they... asking him because he apparently, you know, he's asking for my name. If I do not give my name, will I be arrested? If I get, because I don't want to be arrested. That's not my. That's not why I came here. I came to ask questions. Oh, I understand that. You see what I'm saying? I understand. So that. if I need to give my name under duress of being arrested because it's a law, then I will gladly give my name. But if I don't have to give my name and you can just give me the trespass notice, then that's fine. Well, Corporal Tardiff is going to figure that out right now. I just want to know because, I mean, I haven't broken any laws as far as I know. They, The guy, I like, literally, you want to know what happened? I can show you on the camera. He, oh, uh... Yeah. I literally was like, we can go out here in this lobby because, you know, this one's kind of packed full and I want to be able to hear what you're saying. And he goes, why do you have an attitude with me? And he's like, I'm not talking to you. What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? And I'm like, really? I'm like, all I wanted to do was come to your town office and ask you a couple of questions. That's it. What was the purpose of you asking questions? I'm asking questions about the town. I know, but why? Historical questions, because I want to. Okay. It's a free country, is it not? No, you're right. There you go. Well, then, if, so, you're, just, if, you're, just here, if you're just here doing that simple of a task, well, how hard is it to give us your name? Because I don't want to be on your police report. I don't have to be on your police report because I didn't break your laws, right? Uh, if well, I didn't break... Well, is well, public photography a, uh, against the law? You are being asked to leave. Okay, that's fine. And I left. I'm on the sidewalk right now. Am I not? Oh, yeah, because we walked over here with you. <laughs> now, come on. I would have walked over here without you. <laughs> you and I both know that. <laughs> it's not like I'm being removed from the place, even though he did touch my arm. I asked you to leave, and you didn't leave. That's why I touched your arm. Well, I was just wondering why I had to leave. Uh, because I told you to. That's why. So it's... Can I talk okay. to you for a minute? Yeah. I'm just wondering, do I have to give you my name under duress? I don't want to get arrested. Especially since I haven't broken any laws. So, do I need to give you my name under threat of being arrested? No. I do not? Okay, good. Are you going to give me a piece of paper that says I'm trespassed? I'm going to tell you that you can't come back here. That's good enough. Ver verbal trespass notice that you can't come back. Okay. Is that fair enough? Sounds good. Okay, all right. You can leave now. All right. You're free to go. Have a good day. Okay. Have a good one. I'm not on their property, right? Uh, you are every now, yes. You need to step off to the sidewalk. This, this is the sidewalk? You're gonna play that game. <laughs> I'm not playing a game. I just want to know: Am I on the sidewalk? Yes or no? No, you're in front of the building. You need to move down here, off, off, off the property. Okay, so this is off the property. I'm just, I'm trying to follow you guys' orders. That's all, right. all I'm doing. All right, have a good day. Have a good one. So, 
I went in that gas station over there, walking towards the uh, police department in Brewer, and I got this cop right here watching me, because I was just criminally trespassed, criminally trespassed from the town office even though I broke no laws. Makes a lot of sense. And now he's leaving because he knows that he's been caught. Make no sense. Don't want me to get enough uh, evidence of them uh, following me, I guess. After the officers huddle in shame as they try to figure out, years after being hired, what their job is and how to do it, TRG is released. He then walks to the Brewer Police Department, being followed the entire time, and conducts an audit of the department. I will link this full video and the police department audit below. If you head over there, be sure to let him know I sent you, and urge him to continue his efforts as it has been two years since his last video. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think of this incident in comments below. If you have an incident you'd like me to review, email it, submit it on my website, or through Facebook Messenger. All links are down below. That concludes our video for today. Please subscribe and turn on all notifications so you never miss a video. If you're old here, like, share, comment down below what you think of this interaction and consider a channel membership or merch to further support the channel. If you have an incident you'd like us to review, link it down below or contact us through the social media platforms linked in the description.